Gold Rush star Parker Schnabel has always been known for his bold moves and risk-taking in the pursuit of gold. However, this season has proven to be one of the toughest challenges he has faced in his decade-long career of mining in Canada's Yukon Territory. The spotlight is now on his newest venture, Dominion Creek, a vast, untouched land that Schnabel acquired for a whopping $15 million, a gamble that could potentially yield 80,000 ounces of gold, valued at $160 million. The decision to invest such a substantial amount up front was undoubtedly a daunting one for Schnabel. The stakes were high, and the pressure was on as his mining operation faced a rough start to the season. Viewers witnessed moments when it seemed like Parker Schnabel's gamble might not pay off, with a potential threat of bankruptcy looming over his business. Despite the rocky start, Schnabel's resilience and strategic thinking came to the forefront. Adapting to the challenges, he expanded his operations by dividing the crew into several groups to increase mining efficiency. The gamble began to pay off, and as of episode 21, Parker Schnabel has mined an impressive 6,544 ounces for the season. Just 2,000 more ounces are needed to break the all-time gold rush record. Parker's current best season stands at 8,309.75 ounces, achieved in season 12. With the current season's momentum, he is on the verge of surpassing this record. Leading the pack, Schnabel has left competitors like Tony Beats, Rick Ness, and the McCon family far behind. Gold Rush Season 14 is approaching its final weeks, and the teams are working tirelessly to extract as much gold as possible before winter sets in. Parker Schnabel's history of breaking records is not new. In 2018, during Discovery's ninth season of Gold Rush, he and his crew ended the season with over 7,400 ounces of gold, earning a substantial $8.5 million. However, Parker's competitive spirit pushed him to exceed his own achievements season after season. The following year, his haul reached $10.8 million, although it fell short of breaking the 7,400-ounce record. Parker Schnabel's journey is marked by constant improvement and surpassing his own milestones. Despite the challenges brought on by the COVID-19 pandemic during the 11th season, he dug up an astounding 7,500 ounces of gold, amounting to a staggering $14 million. Both records were shattered, leading to a joyous celebration within the crew. Season 12 was particularly challenging, but against all odds, Parker concluded with 8,309.75 ounces of gold, surpassing all previous records. Season 13 saw Schnabel amassing an impressive 8,118 ounces, surpassing the 50,000-ounce mark at the young age of 28. His relentless pursuit of success continues to propel him to new heights in the gold mining industry. Gold mining is a financial risk, as highlighted by Parker Schnabel himself. The unpredictability of finding gold in the vast Alaskan ground can lead to both amazing and terrible weeks. The concentration of gold in specific areas determines the outcome, making it a business with highs and lows. Schnabel's ability to navigate these challenges and consistently break records showcases his exceptional skills and determination in the competitive world of gold mining. As Gold Rush Season 14 heads towards its conclusion, all eyes are on Parker Schnabel, anticipating another record-breaking triumph in his illustrious career. Parker Russell Schnabel, born on July 22, 1994, in the rugged landscapes of Alaska, is a prominent American gold miner and reality television star best known for his role in the popular TV show Gold Rush and its spin-off, Gold Rush, Parker's Trail. His journey in the world of mining began at the tender age of five, setting the stage for a remarkable career filled with challenges, successes, and record-breaking achievements. Parker's introduction to the mining world was influenced by his family, particularly his grandfather, John Schnabel. At the age of five, Parker started working at his grandfather's Big Nugget Mine in Haines, Alaska. His early exposure to heavy machinery laid the foundation for the skills that would later propel into success. John Schnabel recognized Parker's potential, and by the time Parker turned 17, he was entrusted with the responsibility of being the boss of the Big Nugget Mine. However, Parker's ambition extended beyond this family mine. 
At the age of 18, he made a bold move, venturing to the Klondike and leasing a piece of land from the legendary Klondike gold miner, Tony Beats. Parker's business acumen and strong work ethic did not go unnoticed. His endeavors caught the attention of the Discovery Channel and Raw TV, leading to the opportunity to share his passion for mining with the world on television, similar to Marty Legina's journey. Although Parker Schnabel had a relatively modest start in Gold Rush Season 1, his significant role emerged in Season 2, where he took over the Big Nugget Mine. Despite earning around $55,000 in gold during his first eventful season, Parker's determination and growth were evident. In the following seasons, he continually raised the stakes and his earnings. Season after season, Parker faced new challenges and reached greater heights. From mining 192 ounces worth over a quarter of a million dollars in season 3 to breaking the show's record with a haul of 836 ounces in season 4, Parker consistently outdid himself. His achievements reached new peaks in season 5, mining 2,538 ounces valued at just under $3 million. As the seasons progressed, Parker Schnabel's success skyrocketed. In season 6, he hauled in $3.5 million worth of gold, a figure that climbed to over $5 million in season 7. The trend continued in season 8, where he mined an astounding 6,280 ounces of gold, worth a staggering $7.5 million. Season after season, Parker set and surpassed his own goals. In season 9, he exceeded his 7,000-ounce target, digging up 7,427 ounces and making almost $9 million in profits. The following year, although falling short by 204 ounces, Parker's earnings increased to approximately $10.8 million due to mining his own ground and the rising gold prices. Even amidst the challenges of 2020, Parker Schnabel's resilience shone through in season 11, bringing in 7,504 ounces of gold. Season 13 marked another milestone as he and his crew extracted a remarkable 8,118 ounces, resulting in an estimated $14 million in profit. As season 14 unfolds, Parker Schnabel's legacy on Gold Rush continues to shape up in his favor. Despite having the means to retire to one of the most expensive penthouses in the world, Parker remains committed to the family business that has not only netted him millions but also made him one of the most recognizable figures on the Discovery Channel. His unwavering dedication and relentless pursuit of success indicate that, for Parker Schnabel, the sky is truly the limit in the world of gold mining. Parker Schnabel's unprecedented success in the gold mining industry has become a beacon of inspiration for countless individuals around the world. His journey, from a young boy learning the ropes at his grandfather's mine to becoming a prominent figure on Gold Rush, resonates with aspiring miners, entrepreneurs, and enthusiasts alike. Parker's relentless work ethic, strategic decision-making, and ability to overcome adversities have not only propelled him to new heights but have also inspired a generation of viewers. His story serves as a testament to the transformative power of dedication, resilience, and a passion for one's craft. As viewers witness Parker consistently break records and exceed his own limits, they find motivation to pursue their own dreams, whether in the mining industry or any other field. Parker Schnabel's success is more than a narrative on television, it's a source of encouragement that encourages others to embrace challenges, take risks, and strive for greatness in their own endeavors.